Hi, uh, welcome back. Uh, so I guess uh, in this video I'm going to answer this next question. Um, do you find you have topics you move through at different paces? Uh, and uh, my answer is yes, absolutely. Absolutely. I feel like I, I, there are different things that I move through at, at different paces. And now I think that the important thing uh, that I've really found, you know, there there are definitely different topics that I move through at different paces. Like, you know, for instance, you know, I, I know I've talked about before that, you know, I, I uh, you know, uh, uh, got a music degree and did music in high school and everything. I feel like I move through music much faster, much faster, much faster than I do through through math. You know, math, you know, maybe this is a speed vector. My music ve speed vector, or it's, I guess, a, a uh, velocity vector. My music velocity is much higher, uh, and mu is much faster than my math vector, ma. If I guess I can, if I, if I can think about that, think about it that way. Um, you know, I, I think I, there are different things that I'm able to move, uh, you know, move through much faster um uh but i think the like and i think that that you know it's important to recognize that you know some things are going to take you much longer to to get through um i think sometimes it can be uh i think sometimes it can really um uh Sometimes if you are taking a really, really long time to get through something, you know, like sometimes when, a, uh, you know, like I, I, uh, you know, I, I, I work as a tutor for, uh, the, uh, the college of engineering right now. And, uh, sometimes if I'm tutoring some, someone in, uh, you know, uh, like circuits two, if I'm tutoring someone in circuits two and, uh, we're, you know, moving, you know, we're moving very, very, very slowly. Often, I think you can trace, like, you know, and, you know, if someone is moving through very, very, very slowly, often I think you can trace, uh, uh, trace the, the reason for, for that pace back to, you know, an incomplete understanding of circuits one. And often you can trace that to an incomplete understanding of, you know, basic linear algebra or basic or, or basic algebra. Um, so I think that, um, you know, you definitely move through topics at different paces, but I think that sometimes you have to diagnose why that is like a little bit, I think, you know, uh, a little bit, I think that, um, you know, you, you just are, you're always going to move through different things at different paces. Some things I think might come, I don't want to say that things come naturally to you. I think that, you know, really everything you do, you really have to learn. Um, you know, I, I kind of find it hard to believe that, you know, when people say, oh yeah, playing saxophone comes naturally. It's like, oh yeah, you were born knowing how to do this, but, you know, um, uh, you know, I, I, uh, I think, you know, everything you, you really do have to learn, you know, there, I, I think that you are going to move through, you are natural, you are going to move through things at different paces. But I think that sometimes if you are moving through something at a very slow pace, uh, sometimes I think you have to be able to diagnose that as not understanding something that is more fundamental than whatever you're working on. So I guess my, my answer to this, you know, do you have, do you find you have topics you move through at different places is different paces is yes. Um, you know, yes, absolutely. I move through things at different paces. Uh, but what I would say is that there are, you know, uh, that, uh, there are different reasons why you would move th through things at different paces. Um, and you know, both things are, you know, they, I think that they happen to everyone. It's not like you're a bad learner that you move through things at different paces or that you need to take a, an awful lot of time to, uh, learn something. However, if you are, you know, basically stuck on something, you know, and moving through something incredibly slowly, uh, I think that, uh, you have to be able to diagnose that as, you know, not understanding something that's more fundamental uh, than what you're working on.
No, you know, you have to be able to recognize that you're having a problem with something that kind of came before uh, whatever you're working on. So uh, anyway, I guess that's what I have to say on that. My, my answer is yes. Uh, thanks for watching.